All right, so this is going to be a potentially a farming simulator 22 let's play of sorts. Um, haven't played this game in a while now, so just jump into downloads. We'll see if we can find a decent map. Um, nothing crazy. I'll download that and then just kind of give it a go, see what we can get from there. Um, I'm going to turn this down on my end. I uh, don't know if it's picked up on the mic or not, but it's pretty loud. Uh, right, okay, so that's that turned down. Um, what have we got? I already have the Mission to Mars one. Wasn't a big fan of it. Um, oh, right, what have we got here? I can want one with like large open areas, but like hills, but not like mountain kind of style hills. I just want like a kind of gentle rolling hills. Um, whoa. Let's see. What have we got? What have we got? What have we got? Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to look for a, uh, a map um, and then I'll be back to find one to show you what I'm downloading uh, once, it's, once it's obviously downloaded uh, and then we'll go from there and we can you, can you save. Alright so I went with this one, Bloomfield, Canada. Um, just looking at the pictures, uh, it's a fairly large area. Um, Looks like they've got some rolling hills, which is what I want. I want it to be like a large, flat, but not like level. Uh, and I don't want mountains. It just makes things a little bit more complicated, especially on PlayStation. Um, so we do have this on PC as well, um, but I prefer just playing it on the PlayStation. Uh, just for a wee bit of a more relaxed feel to the game. Uh, I'm going to go through some of the mods that I've got. So. I'll talk over some of them, um, some of them I'll just kind of gloss over and you can see. So the one with the liftable bales, um, I have this installed just for more easiness sake, but it doesn't work on everything, so this is more sort of the bot one, so the ones that will come out of the the machinery, um, I'll still have to use equipment on that. Um, so it will be, for the most part, a more realistic sort of style, um, but there are a few kind of gameplay mod stuff in here as well. Uh, I've downloaded this just because the capacity on it is ridiculous. Uh, there basically is one depending on how much you want to spend on it. Um, and it goes out a hell of a lot faster and I just, I, I don't know, I like this company. Uh, I've got a couple of like barn sheds, uh, multi fruit, That's, this is like God said by the way. Uh, we just buy what you need rather than have to travel all the way into the shop, into the town, just to get it to drive all the way back. It just makes it a hell of a lot easier. Um, a couple of extra stores, uh, trailers, tractors, stuff like that. Uh, obviously I've got all the FS stuff. Um, a few kind of gameplay stuff, like I was saying. Um, I'm just like, you look at them as I scroll through. Uh, this, this right here, so this is what I was using um, as a sort of autoloader. Um, I did have a different autoloader um, that would, would pick up more stuff, but it eventually or one of the updates crashed it and I can't seem to get it to work anymore. So this one doesn't hold a great deal, but it does hold, hold what I'd need. Uh, and of course I've got to have a Lamborghini tractors. I know realistically Lamborghini tractors for like a sort of UK style farm anyway are a bit ridiculous. They don't really work for what we need it for, but I mean it's Lamborghini, you've got to have a Lamborghini. Um, I do have the fish farming mod installed. I have never actually used it. I'm hoping that maybe in this let's play I will get to use it, but to this day I still haven't done it. Uh, got a couple of grape stuff. Again, haven't done anything with the grapes or the olives ever. Uh, so it'll be interesting to have a look at that. Uh, I do have the precision mod installed as well, so we might have a look at that, we might not. Um, what else have we got in here? Yeah, just a couple of basic stuff. Field creator, that's quite handy as well, just obviously allows you to create outside the boundaries and come with the game. Um, so what we'll do is I will create a new one. Uh, I don't like going hard start from scratch because it gives you 500,000. But saying that, if you go easy, it gives you a farm, it gives you all the equipment. So, you know what, we'll just go hard, buy, buy the land and a basic setup and we'll go from there. So like I've said, yeah, I had Mission to Mars on there already. So Bloomfields Canada, Force of Habit, I'll like deselect and reselect. And um, once this is up and run ready to go, um see you then. 
All right, so this is going to be my my character for the game. Um, but believe it or not, he does actually look quite a lot like me. Glasses and the beard, the hairstyle. Um, I don't actually have any of these kind of clothes, to be fair, in real life. But you know what? Safety first, high vis on. Let's do this. So yeah, that's what I was saying. Five hundred thousand straight off the bat. So right. Don't know if this is actually our land. Let's see if I can remember the controls. Uh, right, so... No, we do not have any, so... Is this the town? This looks like the town. Yeah, so... That's a big, big-ass field. How much is that? And uh, this field is... Oh, wow. Yeah, right, so we're well off that. So... <laughs> That was kind of what I expected, but I'd kind of like to be near the kind of shop area, say towns area, all that kind of stuff, but I'd like to be too close. Um, you know, where we are right now actually might not be a bad idea, so how much is that? Uh, 231,000. Let's actually go and have a look at it first. Uh, right, okay. Yeah, rolling hills, nice. What's in here just now? Sugar beet. Ooh, I don't know though, because I'm pretty sure the sugar beet, where is it? Beet technology. And to rent, even. It's quite pricey. They're all quite expensive. I mean, this is the cheapest one. Uh, to lease that for. I don't know then. So maybe, maybe we don't go this field to start with. Oh, my present. <laughs> maybe we go. Well, that one's only sixty-one thousand two hundred. Uh, doesn't look there's anything in it right now. That might be a good start. Oh, how much is field eight? And that might be wheat potentially. Uh, let's go and have a look. Oh, they didn't realise this was far away. Well, oh. Yeah, I'm going to need to get vehicles and that pretty soon, but I just want to make sure we've got a field first, because if you don't buy a field first and then you start buying your equipment, that's you kind of stuck there. So this looks like, yep, yeah, wheat ready to harvest as well. So that's, we could do this ready to go straight away. There are weeds in it, and that's going to affect the yield, obviously, but I mean, we're buying this field, we're getting it for free anyway, so I see that as a win, uh, and we can obviously do all that kind of stuff ourselves, so yeah, I think we'll buy field 8, so, oh, what am I saying, field 8, it's field 4, where, I, where was I getting 8 from? Oh, is it? Why is it, oh, it says 4 there, though? Oh, that's strange, right, okay, uh, right, okay, so we'll buy that. Uh, and then we're going to need to buy some vehicles, so we need, um, what do we need again? I guess it's been a while since I've played this game, so give me a couple of minutes to get back into it. So we need some sort of harvester, right? I know that, right? So harvester, right? The cheapest one, 75,000. We are currently sitting at 268,540. Uh, so these are the ones I like, but yeah, we're going to need to save up for them. Yeah, they're way out. Oh, those ones I like, actually. Yeah, those are the ones I like. But that's well out of the way. So I'm thinking we maybe just go for the, the Nova 330. Um, don't really need to change any of that. So we'll buy that. Because I like to buy my combine. Because I feel like it's a good investment to have. So we've bought that. Uh, we need to get combinations. And we need this we'll buy that as well yep so we've got one six eight five forty left uh we do need a tractor and a trailer so we'll get the trailer first i think um yeah i think we'll get the trailer first so where are trailers nah, i've just been stupid here <laughs> first one on the list right okay um so i know the class is pretty good uh right so that's Six, sixteen point eight, big jump though. Oh, but that's eighteen point five. Is that one of those duo? Yeah, I don't like reversing those though. They're pretty annoying. Eighteen point five. 
at the axle, so that should be, I think we might actually go with this. Get it close to the difference though. I think that, that just can be modified, is that what it is? Configuration, extension, do we want the extension just now? Would that be a good investment? You know what, I think we go for it. I think we get the extension and plan for the future, so we'll buy that. Okay, so I've got 132,540 left. I'll have a look at some tractors. Now, if I can skip the small tractors, then I will. Just have a quick glance through what's in here. I think if we can skip them and go straight to medium, we'll be better. Oh, but they are really expensive. Right, okay. I really wish you could kind of like filter on this by price, but... Oh well, right. Do like the Valtras, Landinis. Valtra again, I do like the Valtras. Um, let's see what modded ones we've got in here. Okay, there's a mod. Well, they do have that Lamborghini, but it's out of a price range. Hmm. Right, okay. I think we might go for a Valtra. If I can afford one. So we can't afford. <laughs> don't think we'll be able to afford a Valtra. Hmm. Right, okay. So expensive. Let me massy. So, hundred. I mean, hundred seventy horsepower is not bad, especially if this is going to be our first tractor. I think we go with this. Um, front loader attach or that. How much is that going to set as though? That's actually not bad. Put this. Oh, but that adds a lot of money onto it. True. Right, okay. Do we do the precision farming just now? I think we wait till the whole next year or we've got more money before we do precision farming. But that point we probably don't even have this tractor anyway, so I think we'll leave it. But front loader attacher, definitely. Wanna get that. Uh, uh, configure not get configuration? Oh, maybe not. Right, okay. Front loaders, I'm sure this is far down the bottom. Yep. Uh, and I think is there a modded one? Oh, that's for the one of the tractors. Okay. Uh, I think we'll just get this one. That'll be fine. Uh, in combinations. Did we get a bucket? Mm. Oh, I think we need forks. There's probably left in it. I think those forks are probably going to be the most useful. I don't want the bale spike. Although, saying that, I think I have a modded bale king here with the auto grab. Yes, I do. 3,000. I think that's going to be worth it. Yeah, I think we'll go with that. Okay. Right. So let's go and see what we've got. And I, I'm going to allow myself... Alright, wait there. I need to adjust these settings first because I'm not having any... I have to start it myself. Just turn it on. Ah, rather that was on. There we go. Right, so you zoom out a bit anyway. Uh, I'm going to allow myself tabbing two vehicles. Is that that stop go thing? Stop go brake. Aye, that's what I want. I want that. Is it? Maybe it's not. Hmm. Off. What set is that? Does that mean to press it twice? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Oh god, crashing in already. Right, so. There we go. There we go. Attach that. I need to get some sheds and stuff. Maybe even a cheap silo. I love this on. There we go. Can you imagine seeing that driving down the road to you? Be terrified. Oh, that's quite a bit of bump there. Oh, no, it's not. It looks higher than it actually is. That's having to press the trigger twice thing is going to take a bit of getting used to. Uh, right, okay, so we want to go to, where is it, field 8? Oh, that's the wrong one. And, I don't know, I could have went the other way, but it doesn't matter. Right, so it says 4, but it is 8. So we are currently, where the hell are we? Oh, the shop's this side. Oh, right, damn. Okay, right, we're basically just going all the way up there. Up there. And up there. That's fine. Right, we'll drive this over. Uh, we'll drive this over, and 
once I've got it, I'll tab back to the combine and then we'll drive that over. So I think once I've got all the equipment over to near the field, I will see you there. See you in a minute. So uh, I'm going to say, I'm just going to jump back in quite literally while I'm driving this. I really wish I'd realised the shop was at the other end of the map because this is a really long straight road and at 24 miles an hour, you know, it takes a while. The uh, yeah, just wanted to jump in and say that, so I'll see you once I've got them both over at the new, the new field. Uh, right, so I'm just going to jump back in just because I feel like people might want to see connecting this, but I won't bore you with the horrifically long drive to get back, and now seeing this uh, combine head, oh man, that field's going to take so long. But you've got to start somewhere, so right, I'll see you back. Right, so we're just coming up to where I imagine the main yard is probably going to go one day. Um, field's just behind us, obviously I've parked the tractor and the trailer here. Um, and I think we're just going to jump straight into this. Um, one thing I was concerned about... Oh, I'm going to get in here, it's up this way. One thing I was concerned about on the way up was we only have £24,000 left. Um, and once this field is done, there's going to be bales that we'll need to move um, but the field's also going to be cultivated and we're going to buy seeds so I don't know how we're going to do on this this might have been a mistake why am I not going backwards there we go plus this is going to take forever so I want to lower it I want to turn on the harvester and yeah no access but I do have access to this uh, we're just going to go for it. So this will be a mix of time lapse, a couple of cuts, um, and I'll just see you when this is uh, all done. Before I go though, at uh, any point if this starts to get really tedious, I am just going to hire a worker. Um, but all that, it'll still be time lapse and cuts. And I'll still see you then. I'll see you in a bit. Worker just because the tank is nearly full um, and I want to get this grain into the trailer as soon as possible because I need to have a rough idea of how much this is actually going to fill it up to determine whether uh, I'm selling it straight away or whether I need to buy some sort of silo and I don't actually know which side the pipe is here. Uh, it looks like it's on maybe the left. I'm going to have to wait till it gets down to the end because um, I don't know if I've kept it in the video yet or if I've cut it out. If I'm saying this, I might keep a little bit in. Coming along this side right up the edge, you can't really see where the edge is. All you see is all these trees. That's, what, that's your view. You just... Oh, I've just crashed into the company. Uh, this is kind of all you see, just trees after trees. It's a bit of a nightmare. Uh, but we'll maybe try and squeeze up just now. Get up. So you don't... Oh, can. Probably not. 
with new life, but try and keep this as central as possible. Oh god, I'm doing a horrible job here. Way up front. In the middle. In the middle. Oops, hold on a bit. Oh, speed back up. Come on, Ross. You got this. You got this. What's he going to do at the end? Is he going to wait for me or what's he going to do here? Oh. Back it up. Yeah, he's going to wait for me. Right, that's good. So we'll see how full we get of this. Uh, and that can determine whether I'm going to buy some sort of silo. I think we're going to buy one anyway. I don't think we're going to get this full through done here. Right, so 5%. And that was basically one and a bit laps. Where are you going? Oh, you're going to start going up there, mate. Okay. So while he's doing that, I think well, we've still got the money before he spends it all. Uh, we should maybe buy um, silo now. Where are silos again? How do I do this? Is it this? Oh, we're saving, we're getting a save. I don't think it's this button. I need to try and remember all the controls. It's definitely in here. Tools, objects, packs, use vehicles. Oh, we didn't actually look at that. Oh, there's a trailer there as well, of course there is. Can't fix it. Oh, damn it, oh, more. Right, okay. Uh, items, least, mods, construction. There we go. I do know there is a shortcut, but can't quite remember what it is. Silos. I do like these, but not right now, so. Silo, silo, silo. Just a little green silo. It's not going to break the bank. I don't want one where I need an auger for it. Uh, well, that's pretty good. But it's 45,000, so that's way out of a price range right now. Farm silo. 10,000. Multi fruit as well. What does it look like? Oh, that, that could work. Now, where can we actually build? Do I have to keep it in this field? Or do I own any of this? I do not. Right, so in the field it is. Well, that is a bit of a problem because I have stuff here. Uh -huh. Right, okay, so. We may have to sell straight away, so. It's uh, in this one, this does. Wheat. Uh, trying to find where the selling one is. Wheat, wheat, wheat. It's on the way down. Uh, August is the best time. Its highest is 7.15. What was it currently? Oh god, pressing all the wrong buttons now. Um, it's actually higher, so. 2.22. That's a good place. How far away is that? Is that miles away? So I'm not even halfway through this field yet, and I'm just trying to think ahead, planning what I'm going to be doing, how I'm going to get there. Um, and I'm thinking, we've bought this pretty large field, if I'm honest, for our first field. Uh, now, if we look at the size of it, compared to what our equipment actually is, um, I should probably turn this into two, maybe three fuels, plus have the top part of this be the yard. I know I was saying kind of over there, where it looks like the kind of games defaulted to where the house and the barns and all that used to be. Uh, that's twice I've done this because I've been <laughs> not really paying attention with the cruise controller. Um, I'm thinking we actually just do the top of this field as a sort of area where we want to have all the equipment stored, grain so uh, stored, animals potentially. Um, all that kind of stuff. Uh, yeah, I know, I'm like outside of the land. But, uh, I've not went wide enough, no! There we go. Can I save it? Um, obviously, I'm going to come back and fix the bits that I have completely messed up on. But yeah, I just wanted to kind of let you in on what my thought process was. Uh, I'm also going to, need to get a cultivator, a windrower, a baler. Um, so, I'm going to, need to get quite a lot of stuff. So. I don't know if I'm going to sell much of this grain, maybe just the, the first trailer, uh, just to get a little bit of money going, because uh, I do need to get that, uh, as a minimum, the baler, to get more money for the bales. If I can get the wind drawer and the baler, perfect, because it'll mean it's not going to take as long, uh, but priority is obviously just going to be the baler. 
uh, not even halfway through this yet, and this is this is what was making me kind of think this because it's a really big field, and I, I know I do have a really small combine. It's the smallest one uh, in the catalog right now that I have access to. Uh, I know there are smaller ones and cheaper ones and stuff like that. I just don't have downloaded. But yeah, my thought process is going to be to divvy this field up, put it into a couple of fields, area up top from a farmyard, um, and we'll go from there. So I will continue back with the time lapses and the cuts. See you in a bit. In real quick because I was like, hmm, why have I not got straw on the ground in this bit? Uh, somehow I accidentally turned off uh, enable straw, so that's not ideal because I have been in turn lost quite a bit of money potentially, so that's not great. Um, yeah, not happy with that because um, I was doing other things um, downstairs like housework, putting away clothes, stuff like that. So I was just leaving the AI on when I come back down. I was like, oh, nearly fuel, uh, full. I'll quickly empty his uh, hopper. And then I was like, hmm, fuel looks a bit weird. And it's just not rendering. No, nope. I've pre clearly pressed the button. So not great, but yeah, we'll just get back to it. I'll set this up. Uh, and I've got a nice uh, time lapse um, angle. Try to get the words there. Uh, and I'll put it back to our time lapse. So we're 97% full. I am just going to let the AI carry on there, and I am going to currently 
straight up sell this. Because thinking ahead, what we need to buy, I can't afford to get the silo first. I think we're just going to have to do a straight sell. Farmer's market. No, I think it's going to be up this way. Oh, not the we sign. And there's traffic everywhere. Hopefully there's a kind of green spot up here or something. Otherwise I've just done that massive drive for nothing. Ah, I didn't like it. Right, okay, we're going to turn around. That's the ideal, right? Onto the map. And of course I've got a save. I can also only record for up to an hour at a time, so I'm currently uploading the first part of the video to then download. Uh, right, so that was all I've changed anyway. Grain mill. Dag place, where are you? So the other end. Oh, it's not that far. I'll just go with that one then, because it's now currently the best. So it's not the end of the world, so that drive wasn't totally worth it. Uh, it wasn't totally, sorry, not worth it, I should say. Um, it's a bit annoying, because I need to work out where the, the train place is, where, where I can green in and actually hire the train but you know we'll, we'll go with what the best is at the time so we'll go here hopefully this isn't just some dude's house it is actually that big green mill which actually looks pretty cool it's pretty impressive so uh, i think it's in here looks like it just up here uh, is this a drive through or a back it up uh, it looks like a drive through perfect uh, I need to work out how to operate the trailer again, so... Oh, it literally just says, so, R1 triangle. Oh, we need to get back pretty quick, because the uh, worker is 80% full. How much are we going to get for this? Hoping at least five. Definitely doing more than five, so this is, um, it's pretty good. First load. Oh, 17 plus an environment. Oh, but we lost money with the environmental score penalty. I suppose that's because it probably wasn't weeded. Um, we literally just bought the fields, harvested as is. So, yeah, I can see why we're getting a bit of a deduction there. It's so American there. Deductions. God. Um, yeah, we'll quickly race back up. 40 grand in the bank. Alright, so we did make it back in time, but, you know, it just. The AI worker stopped, stopped charging us, so it wasn't the end of the world. I just wish it would, um, wasn't as full so it could continue cutting. So we've only got this much more to go on the cut. Um, I'm just trying to work out time wise personally um, if I'm going to have time to do this in this first episode or if I'm going to carry it on to the next one. Uh, I've still got mm, the 10 15 minutes left before I need to, to leave. Uh, so hopefully I can get us done in that time. We just won't be getting any of the the hay picked up or any sort of yard work done. It will just be literally we've bought this field and started cutting it, and and we've sold off a grain, or sold a grain in the trailer, um, and that'll be the first video. And hopefully the next couple of videos, if I do them, will be that more productive, there'll be more stuff in it and um, now that we're going to have smaller fields because I'm going to divvy this up, it should be uh, we'll be able to focus more on completing the task in said episode um, but yeah, just for the first video, getting a feel of it, seeing what the how to upload, how to edit, doing all this stuff again that again I haven't done for years um, it's going to be good it's going to give me more enjoyment in this game as well, I'm going to actually get to play it progressively rather than just buying everything maxed out and then it's like right well what do I do now so hopefully it's gonna be good so I'm gonna cut it here again and hopefully the next time I see you will be field harvested
Right, so we're nearly there. This last main strip, and then just a little odd wee bits that uh, I missed with how was uh, using my computer and cruise control at the same time, talk to use, using cruise control at the same time, not really paying attention. Uh, but I'll sort them out pretty quickly. Uh, I am pushing this a lot for time, um, so I'll basically be finishing this field, loading up the, the trailer with the seats, and uh, hopefully that's only one trailer, it's not the two, otherwise it's a little bit of pain. Uh, and then I'll just need to call it there. Uh, everything else we'll do, we'll do in the next episode. Uh, I don't know how frequent these are going to come out. Um, it's, again, it's more just for me as a hobby, just to allow myself to be interested in the game, playing the game the way it's probably more intended to, rather than just giving yourself lots of money, buying everything most expensive, the best stuff. Oh, there's my ring doorbell going. Well, one of someone out in the garden, I think. Yeah, one out in the garden. Uh, so I, I just want to make it more for myself, keep myself interested, like I was saying. Um, and it'll be a case of, yeah, I'm finishing recording this, but then I need to go to the gym, and I'll pretty much need to go to my bed uh, not long after it, so it'll be a while before I even get to edit this, whether it'll be tomorrow or the day after, I don't know. So I don't know how long it's going to be before this episode even gets uploaded, whether that's going to be a regular thing that I'm going to be doing when it's a record, it takes like a whole week, so like an episode a week, I don't know. Um, hopefully not. I want to try and get at least two out a week if possible, because it means that I'm getting more chance to actually play the game. Um, but we'll just need to see what happens. So I think this is the first bit that I missed. Uh, so we'll quickly grab that wee bit. Shouldn't be too bad, there's a little bit next to it as well. Um, so this is the big strip where I somehow accidentally turned off um, straw. But, you know, not much I can do about it now. I didn't notice until a couple of runs in. Uh, with the AI worker that I had to go on because I was doing things, I wasn't in the room. So that's that first first hour long video finally uploaded I think. Keep refreshing the page. So it's processing in HD now so it's not going to be long. But yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this. Um, wish I could have done more in this first episode but it is what it is. Um, and like I said, we'll divvy this field up into three three bits, possibly two fields and a yard. Um, God, I need to wash this. This is absolutely filthy. Uh, we'll sell that other load. We'll hopefully be up about 70, 80,000 at that point then. Um, so we'll be sitting good enough to get cultivators and balers, hopefully windrowers as well to, um, to make this a little bit quicker. Um, but yeah, so thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoy this and I will see you next time. Bye.